Hello friends, welcome to CSS video tutorials series. From this video tutorial onwards, for the next few video tutorials, I would like to discuss CSS list properties. First CSS list property I am going to discuss is CSS list style type property. CSS list style type property is used to specify the bullet symbol to be displayed in front of list items of a HTML order list or unordered list. Various values that we can assign to list style type property are decimal, decimal leading zero, upper alpha, lower alpha, upper roman, lower roman, none, disk, circle, square, etc. In this video tutorial, especially I am going to concentrate on CSS list style type property versus HTML ordered list. In the next video tutorial, we discuss CSS list style type property versus HTML unordered list. Let me minimize the Word document. I go to the notepad. You can see here, I have already opened default.html in the notepad. It has the basic HTML document structure code written. Title is set to CSS properties demo. I have already opened default.html in the Chrome. Title is set to CSS properties demo. I hope you guys have remembered while learning HTML, we discussed about ordered list and unordered list. To create an ordered list, we use OL tag. OL tag is a paid tag, so we write a separate opening and separate closing OL tag. To add a list item to the ordered list, we use LI tag. So LI tag is also paid tag. Within that, I can put any content. At present, I say item. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that browser is displaying automatically one dot space item. Okay. If I want to add one more list item, I have to copy this li tag, paste down, file, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that now it is displaying two dot space item. Automatically the number is getting incremented, right? Order list is always going to be displayed in an ascending order. Automatically the items are placed in an order. That is the reason they are called as ordered list. Using the HTML tags, we can create ordered list something like this. By default, the list type is set to decimal number one. Type equal to one will be there behind the scene. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that there is no change. If you do not give the value to type, still the ordered list type will be one. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that we are getting still 1, 2. The default value of a type attribute will be 1. That actually indicates a decimal number. Remember that. How do we create the same order list by using the CSS? To do that, I am going to copy this order list, paste down. Instead of using the type attribute, now I use the CSS inline styles. Here I say list style type. I am using the list style type property. And I assign the value to it decimal. I am going to assign the value by using the colon decimal and I say here semicolon at the end. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that we are getting the same decimal number list, right? Let's proceed and understand something more. I am going to copy this order list, paste down. Now I am going to use HTML OL tag, only HTML code to create another order list. This time I give a alphabets upper alphabets right capital letter a i have given file save go to browser and refresh you can see now the browser is creating list items with the bullet set to upper alphabets in an incremented order a b if i add one more item it is going to display c here automatically okay now we know how to create ordered list which has a bullet set to upper alphabets how do we create the same order list by using the CSS? I'm going to copy this order list code, paste down. Here, I'm going to give the value upper alpha. Saying list style type colon upper alpha semicolon is same as type equal to A in HTML. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see I'm getting the same order list I'm getting. Let me go back. I'm going to copy this, paste down here. Now I use smaller a or lowercase a. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see now we are getting small letter a's or lowercase a, b, c like that, right? To create similar order list, I'm going to copy that code, 
page down here i use lower alpha file save go to browser and refresh you can see that browser has created another list which is same as the previous list right similarly i can use i'm going to copy this paste down i give here capital letter i when i write here type equal to i it is going to create an ordered list containing bullet of roman numbers file save go to browser and refresh you can see now we have roman letter 1 2 right if i add one more item it will display 3 4 in roman i'm going to copy this order list code and paste down here i am going to say value upper dash roman saying list style type colon upper roman semicolon is same as type equal to i file save go to browser and refresh you can see i am getting the same output right similarly i am going to copy this order list code paste down here this time i use small letter i that creates the lower roman numbers list file save go to browser and refresh you can see we are getting lower roman numbers right 1 2 like that similarly i am going to copy this ol code and paste down and replace the value with lower roman file save go to browser and refresh this time i am using the css inline style list property that is list style type lower roman value and displaying a list with lower numbers right roman numbers i hope you guys have understood how we can use the css list style type property to create different kinds of order list only one value that we have not used is decimal leading zero i go back here at the top we have ol type equal to 1 right it is displaying a list with 1 2 3 like that file save go to browser and refresh you can see we are getting 1 2 if i write here 0 it will not display list items with a bullet 0 1 0 2 0 3 like that no file save go to browser and refresh there is no change whereas if i say here decimal leading 0 file save go to browser and refresh you can see automatically the browser has added 0 0 in front of 1 9 2 in css you get more facilities to display the list items with different bullets that is all about css list style type property versus html ordered list friends in the next video tutorial we discuss css list style type property versus html unordered list for this tutorial this much is enough friends i suggest you people to try using this in your html websites for more benefits and be up to date please subscribe to my youtube channel don't forget to like comment and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited keep learning keep coding keep sharing Thank you guys thank you very much see you in the next tutorial